Elliot, a superb performance today, gets us our first three points on the road this season and back to back wins. Talk us through the game. Difficult game, first off, if I'm perfectly honest. You know, they, um, they threw a th few things at us which were, were, um, we, we struggled to deal with. And, um, you know, our shape, uh, we went with what we, we, we played in, in our previous game um, because it worked so well. Um, but, you know, never two games are never the same. So, um, change it around, you know, on the, on the half hour mark. And, and, and it looked more like us, you know, we played some really good football. We started to create some opportunities. We dealt with maybe some of their things that they were doing. Um, and then second half, I thought we were outstanding. Um, I thought we were brilliant. I thought every single man on the pitch and the lads who came off the bench, you know, the messages were, you know, get back to what we do well. Look after the ball, work hard to win it back. And um, like I say, I thought we were, I thought we were outstanding second half. So Paul Blackett starts his National League North scoring record with two goals and picking up an assist. Just how good was he today? Brilliant. I thought he was brilliant on Tuesday night. Um, he didn't. He didn't get his goal, but his his work ethic for the team, his intensity for the team, his understanding of when to press, when not to press for the team was brilliant, and it set the tone on on Tuesday night at, at home to, to Warrington. And I'm absolutely thrilled. We all are, you know, we're, staff, players. We're all absolutely the club in general. Um, we're thrilled that he's he's got his his two goals. I mean, and you know, two brilliant goals. You know, his first one's typical Blackie type goal, but his second one's absolutely top level finish. You know, you, you couldn't put in the you, you couldn't place in the top corner any 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 better and then like you say what you know a brilliant pass for, for Aiden and I'm delighted that Aiden got his goal um, so you know the, the fact that we've scored some really good goals young Ben Middlemas you know scores after a minute sets us off really really well so yeah the, our four goals were, were excellent um, and just thrilled for, for, for the lads who've scored but also everybody on the in, in the game you know I thought it was a real solid team performance I thought our captain Robert Briggs second half just just took the game by the scruff of the neck and you know, some of his passes for, for Blackie and some of his play in general was was really, really top level. And, um, you know, I'm delighted for him, um, you know, especially, you know, he's got a few personal things going on behind the scenes, but, you know, with his family and stuff, and we all wish them well. But in terms of him, he was he was brilliant. And, you know, I cannot, you know, I cannot heap as much praise on him as uh, what he deserves. He deserves as much praise as he gets because, like I say, I thought he, he took the game by the scruff of the neck and he really, really drove us forward. Ben Middlemas, like you said, just joined the club yesterday and makes his first league start for Shields today. How do you think he got on today? He did really well. Um, you know, I, I know I've known Ben for a long time. Um, he's a real good player. He understands the game. You know, he's been brought up in an environment at Sunderland where you know you have to be good with the ball, and I think you know that that suits us because that's how we want to play. And he slotted into the side really, really well. Um, and you know, the fact that he scored after a minute was brilliant. And um, like I say, he was he's, he's, he's a real he's, you know they've got a good young exciting player on the hands there, and hopefully you know he'll continue to benefit us by playing the way like he did. You mentioned Aidan Woodridge previously. He came on and scored just minutes after coming up the pitch. What more can we expect from him going forward? Just more of that, more of that. Aidan's, Aidan's a fantastic team player. Aidan's the goal scorer. Um, you know, he, he creates opportunities out of nothing. Um, you know, he's probably a little bit unlucky not to be in the side in, in some respects because we've obviously changed shape slightly and it just suited Kyle and Mackenzie a little bit more. But he came on and, you know, he did his, did his role really well. And yeah, you know, like I said, the whole team were, were outstanding. And I mean, the other thing that I, I really need to mention is, you know, our supporters today were brilliant. You know, this, this journey down, you know, I know you guys have done it as well. It's not, a, it's not an easy journey. It's a really, really long one. You know, we had the, the benefit of coming down here last night, but our fans who've traveled this morning to come down to here you know kudos to them fantastic they were really loud got right behind the side and you know we are really and I keep saying that we are really appreciative of their support and everything that they do for us home and away but to travel this far to have as many as we had here it, it, you know I, I really do find it a little bit uh, overwhelming to be honest with you so fair, fair play to them thanks enjoy your day Elliot cheers thank you